It's DJ Blast. Hello, everybody. Hello, Shaggy. But how are you? I'm great, man. I'm, I'm happy to be visiting on my Back to Maui Tour 2022. So many old friends come out of the woodwork. People I haven't seen for almost 15 years coming out and, uh, and having a good time on the dance floor with me. Okay, so we can make this joke on air because yeah. I used to make this joke about you all the time. You were like the one guy that DJed at the dance that the people met at, <laughs> then were invited back and you DJed yeah. at the wedding, yeah. then back yeah. and you did the kids and all the babies first luau. Correct. Yeah. Like there's whole families yeah. that all they know is a DJ blast. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm honored to be a part of people's families and their very special events, their weddings, their first birthdays, their graduation parties. Their proms and school dances, youth center dances. It's been uh, an amazing... I did over 30 years here on the island uh, before I left for New York. Honestly, to, you know, completely humbled. I'm just, like, amazed when people remember me. Like, I'm just so stoked that people remember me and are... Uh, let me tell you, I'll, I'll tell you something personal, Shaggy. Oh, boy. When I was growing up, my dad was my hero, of course. Mm -hmm. And whenever I went anywhere with my dad... People would see him, and it'd be Eddie, and they'd light up smiling, and they'd stop and chat for a bit, and then be off doing something else. And no matter where I went with my dad, whether we were at the golf course or at the mall or at a store or at a restaurant, there was always somebody that came up to my dad, Eddie, and was smiling and happy to see him. And I always thought to myself, man, that's amazing that people uh, love my dad so much that they made the effort to come and say hi. But when they said his name, they smiled. Mm. And that meant a lot to me. And, of course, that's in the back of my mind as I'm doing my career and I'm trying my best to entertain people and be my best and be the best DJ I can be. And to be back on the island, my dad's passed now, uh, I think it was over 10 years ago he's passed. And to be back on the island, there's a lot of memories, you know, with my dad and stuff. And uh, for people to look at me, say, DJ Blast, and smile. Yeah. It yes. really, wow, you know, and I'm just, I'm, I'm filled with so much appreciation that it's hard for me to express to people other than just thank you, you know, thank you so much. Before, back in the day, you had the van yeah. full of milk crates. Yeah, well, I've always had a big van full of equipment, but yes, it was always records. It was always records. Um, I didn't move into CD until the 2000s. Yeah. And I didn't like CD, and I went back to... Um, actually, I moved from CD to DVD, because I got into videos. And I was mixing DVD, and then I went back to uh, using turntables, because I missed it. So I had to get a computer, move the videos over to a computer, and operate the computer with the turntables. Yeah. But I've been using turntables back now since, like... So I only took a break from turntables for maybe four years of my career. Mm -hmm. But there's just something about turntables that's just magical it's like your favorite mouse on your computer or your favorite game controller you know yeah like, like you can play the game with other controllers but you're not as good mm. so for me like i can i can mix with anything but with turntables like i'm unstoppable so well, you know we should probably like mention the fact that 90s night is coming up yes and and, and you're going to be at the playground i am yes for yeah. the first time i have not played the playground so this is my very first time at the playground oh okay it's like being inside a video game Nice. Yeah, like when you go in there, you're yeah. like, oh, yeah, yeah. Nice. I mean, because you're in New York now, right? Yes, correct. Right. This looks like one of those, those places. Oh, the, like a, like a old school arcade kind of a... Yeah, but mixed with a village rave. I love it. That's, yeah. That's exciting. No, oh, no, it's, you'll love it. Though. 90s night was a great promotion that we did night at Charlie's in Paia. Rest in peace, Charlie's. So many great memories at that venue. We ran that night for about six years, Yeah, once a month, and we always had a line out the door, and just, it was so much fun that what was a small idea between my man Brendan Smith and I, like, hey, you know what I want to do? I want to do a 90s night. Okay, yeah. let's find out where we can do it, and we figured we'd do it for a couple of years, and six years later, it was still going strong, so strong, that when it was time for me to move... I bequeathed the 90s night to a good friend of mine, uh, DJ Geralian, and he did it for another couple of years before the pandemic hit. Yeah, and then the pandemic hit, we did nothing. Yeah, and then it, it, there was nothing that we could do. So, when I came back, when I was planning this trip to come back, I thought, you know, one of the things I really want to do uh, is, is just do kind of a, a 90s night reunion, so I could play with Geralian again, mm -hmm. so I could see some old friends that... 
uh, came out to 90s night at, at uh, Charlie's and kind of have a, another 90s night, like a one more time kind of a thing mm. for fun. And it seems like the playground would be the perfect venue to, yeah. to have that vibe for 90s night. And yeah, we're going to be there on Friday night. I think the doors open at 8 o'clock, but this is the important part, Shaggy. Okay. There are tickets available for pre-sale. They're at Tixer, T-I-X-R dot com. Search the playground. You'll find the events that the playground has every week. Look, you're going to see me as the Terminator on a motorcycle on the flyer. Yeah. <laughs> you can also go to theplaygroundmaui.com and click through. That You can do that as well. And get your tickets now. Right now, the tickets are $15 ahead. But if you wait, you might not be able to get in. We might sell out. Or you, you might have to pay more at the door than $15 because the door charge is different than the advanced ticket sales. So I want to encourage everybody, go to theplayground.com, click through, go to Tixer, and get your tickets now. $15 a pop. Bring your friends. And if you came to 90s night at pa in Paia, Charlie's, you know exactly what to expect. Right. You know it's you're going to be having the one of the greatest nights of your life with your friends. I'm going to transport you with the music videos, and we're going to go back to the 90s. Spandex, hammer pants. We're going to have some fun... Don't forget to wear your. Remember, uh, Shaggy wears suspenders with one uh, one oh, strap yeah. down. Yes. Oh, yeah. oh god. You yes, know. I remember that. Yeah. 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 You, yeah. And hey, you know what? You should remind people too, since it's been like four years. Yeah. Now. Yeah. If you had a kid since the last time you went to a DJ blast <laughs> party, you would love to see them. <laughs> yes, and I have seen a lot of my friends' kids, and in fact, um, you've been the you've been the calls of most of your friends' kids. <laughs> No comment. <laughs> you know. In fact, I you know I did I did run into uh, some of my friends and I saw their kids and I'm just like you guys are adults now. What? I was only gone for a few years. Like what's going on? You're oh, adults. I know. I know. See, but now that I'm old, I should probably ask if if the playground has handrails. <laughs> just, so standing in line on Friday nights not so hard on the old bones. <laughs> It's going to be a great night at the playground on Friday night. It's the one and only time I'm going to be playing at the playground this year. And it's the one and only time you're going to have a 90s night. You know, we're going to bring it back for one more epic night in Ma'alaya this Friday, 8 o'clock. And uh, who knows how late we're going to go. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll break some rules. <laughs> maybe I'll break some rules. What are they going to do? I'm going back to New York next week. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I mean, come out for this Friday night. DJ Blast going to be doing it all right. Nice. Yeah. Get in where you fit in. Okay. Look at that. Shaggy freestyling. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm really excited to see all of you this Friday at the playground for 90s night. DJ Joralian and I are going to be on the turntables, live music videos, all 90s. Nothing but 90s. And let me stress this to you as well. Mm -hmm. No remixes. Oh. We're doing original versions. The versions that you remember. The versions... If you're old enough, the versions of the songs that you had on Casingle, Casingle, <laughs> the versions you had on CD, the versions you went and bought that 12-inch record that you shouldn't have in the DJ section and you took it home anyway and felt like a DJ when you used the extended versions. Yeah, but you had to slide it between the mattress so mom and dad didn't know that you were buying Madonna records at eight years old. Is that Vogue? You're no. not supposed to have that record. Friday, 90s night at the playground. Get your tickets at theplaygroundmaui.com. Blast, thanks for coming through. Thank you, Shaggy. I appreciate it. By the way, this radio station really, I mean, you, I don't know if you guys did this just for me, but the <laughs> Greek tile in here is extraordinary. I, I did not expect the Greek tile. And what is that, a crystal vase next to your computer? That's, I hope people follow you on Instagram what? so they can see what you're actually talking what about. What is this crystal vase? Is this gifted to you from the Queen of England? Like, yeah, well, you know, back in the 90s, it was a different kind of crystal running right. through radio. <laughs> Right after this, this is Root Station Q103. There we are. It's just like money, bruv. Oh, man. See, that's why you better be glad you left, because we would have been doing podcasts. <laughs>